on YouTube. Today we're going to install the oil pan on the uh, budget 5 liter build for the 86 Mustang. Before we get started on that, if you're new here, subscribe, hit the bell. Again, thanks to all my subscribers. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the videos. So without further ado, let's get to it. Alright, some stuff you're going to need. Obviously you're going to need a gasket. This came with the uh, engine rebuild gasket. Along with bolts, I didn't want to reuse the old bolts. I didn't want to pay a lot for a bolt kit. So I went to the local hardware store and bought some grade five bolts. That would be an 11 mil socket, 13 mil socket for that. I don't remember the exact thread pitch. There is a website that has every thread, thread or bolt size for this build. I will put that link in the description. And like I said, 11 mil, 13 mil, an extension and a ratchet and again we'll need engine sealant for the corners the first step you're going to do is make sure that your gasket surface is clean and then we're going to put rtv that corner that corner that corner and that corner Just like that, don't need much, maybe a green pea size drop of it. And then your gasket will only go in one way. Just like that. So make sure you push this down into the groove. Like. Oh, go in there. There we go. That one started. That one's started. That one was started. All right. Then we'll take the oil pan. Bought a new unit off of Amazon. Again, I will link all this stuff in the description. Set it on there like such. And the four larger bolts are gonna go in the end corners by where we put the RTV. So we'll put those in. Start them by hand. That one started. That one started, and then before I put the other bolts in, I will at least run them down a little bit to get the pan and the gasket to fully seat. Like that. Once you hit that part, let's loosen them up a touch so you can move it a little bit more. And I usually start from the one I get started, start dropping them in. And you don't have to drop stuff like that, but you can. Start it. Do that all the way around. 
once you get all the bolts in, then you can go around and tighten them up. You can reason a rubber gasket, it's got stoppers, so you'll know roughly how far to take it. This one here, get rid of the washer. I've noticed, I don't know if the block was drilled and tapped weird, but certain holes would let me use the washer, some wouldn't. So I just kind of went with it as I went around. Like almost this whole side over here would not let me run a washer. That's a new socket set. It's tight. That one's tight. That one's tight. That one's tight. And as you can see, all the bolts are in. All right guys, got the oil pan installed. Last week we installed the front cover and water pump. I'm still waiting on the harmonic balancer to show up. So once that shows up, we'll put that on. You need to put the oil filter adapter on, the oil pressure extension on the other side. So yeah, she's coming together. Almost a complete short block. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you're new here, subscribe, hit the bell. Uh, again, thanks for watching and see you next week.